Hey, Dr. Dan Purser here, danpursermd.com. I'm gonna discuss what's called the 10-year window. What is that? Why do doctors not understand it? Why do patients not even know what it is? The 10-year window accurately described, not the way most physicians think it goes. The 10-year window says that if you've been through menopause, whether natural or surgical, or traumatic or whatever it was that caused you to go to menopause. You have 10 years to start oral estradiol. I know a lot of you are freaking out, don't ever want to take estradiol, all that does and that. I get it. But the ones of you who want to take oral estradiol because it's highly beneficial, it prevents heart disease, the number one killer in women. It actually reduces your risk for breast cancer. It helps with osteoporosis. It prevents strokes, clots, heart attacks, all that. But it's got to be within the 10 year window. So, once you start menopause, you have 10 years to start oral estradiol. Once you start it, in that 10 years, the clock resets. So if you've taken it for a year or two and then quit, you have another 10 years from the day you quit to restart it. Most doctors think the 10-year window means once you go through menopause, you can take hormones 10 years. That's it. You'll hear them say that all the time. It's not accurate, it's not correct, it's not what the literature really says. Look, get my book, it's all documented in there. The 10 year window, you gotta be aware of it. I need to be aware of it. Also, if you have hypertension, you should not be given estradiol postmenopausal. This is Dr. Dan Purser. Hope you understood this. God bless and go in good health. Look, get my book, Estradiol, Estrogens, uh, whatever I called it. 